Hey everybody, how are you? We're back in the shop. Um, I had a young lady come into work yesterday by the name of Jill. Uh, she's building a chicken coop and she wanted to put a corrugated um, roof on the top, steel roof. Um, she wanted to know how she could cut it. I told her she could use a grinder with a metal cutoff wheel. She didn't have a grinder. I told her, purchase it, I'll take it home, I'll cut it, and I'll bring it back to you. You can pick it up at the store. So she agreed to that. She sent me the dimensions on a text. Um, so I am going to cut this. I've made a little fence, and I'll show you that in a second. Um, I made the fence so I can just run the edge of the grinder right against the fence. So I've set this. She needs it 34 inches. I have set this fence at 33 and 3 eighths because of the offset. So using this fence, we should be able to get a nice straight line, and we'll be able to move it over, and we'll cut her a second piece. She needs two of them. So what we're going to do, I put this on, my little vest, so I don't start my clothes on fire with the metal hitting me. I've got some gloves, and I've got my safety glasses. So let's get going on this. I'm going to show you the little fence real quick, and then we'll cut this metal for her. All right, let's get this done. <clears throat> All right, so here's the fence I built. I um, just made it out of a piece of press board, nice and straight. Screwed in a couple 2 by 4s and made sure that the screws that I put in here are below the surface. So when my guard rides up against this fence, they don't hook onto the screws. Um, I have placed this fence at 33 and 3 eighths from that end. And when I run this with the offset of the blade and the guard, I should have exactly a 34 inch piece. So we're gonna go ahead and cut this for her. And then we'll move it down and we'll cut another one. So let's do this. Got our safety glasses, remember? And we've got our metal cutoff wheel. All right, here we go. I'll probably kill the sound because it'll probably be quite loud. And there we go. That's one cut all the way through. And turned out pretty good. So we're going to move it down, put the new piece over there, and then we will um, cut the next one. Pretty simple. Nice straight edge right here. When you're always working with this, make sure you use gloves because this is, can get really sharp. All right, let's cut the next one. And here is cut number two. And there we go. We got two nice pieces for. Let me put some tape on the edge just to keep it from cutting anybody. All right, that's it, guys. All right, so that project is done. That was pretty quick. Couple cuts. That little fence makes it very easy to make a straight line rather than having to try and follow a line drawn on there. Um, so I'm going to text Jill, let her know that the panels are done. I'm going to take them over to the store and let her pick them up. Um, Jill is going to send me some pictures once she installs them on the chicken coop that she's building. I'll include those at the end. And if you can help somebody else out today, please do so. Have an awesome day. And before you go, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you guys later. Bye-bye.